Hey guys, um, welcome to um, Summit 2, Introduction to Statistics, AT 150, fully online course. And this video, I'm going to walk you through the top level course, also help you register with the homework system. So first of all, you log on to the Blackboard, and first of all, you will see the announcement. Um, I'll give you some background information on myself, also and information on the uh, Luma website right, about the homework, quizzes, and midterm finals. You can review that at your convenience. And next thing, I want to um, go to the syllabus, right? Let's open the syllabus. Let's like, walk you through the syllabus. Um, on the course syllabus, um, it has the uh, course information, my name, email address. So um, send me an email, right? If you have any question, in the summer too, and if you encounter difficulty, let me know. Right? Shoot me an email, I'll get back to you. Um, the course information, introduction to statistics, summer two, has full credit, and the mandatory course material, we are using a free online platform called Lumen. Uh, so basically you don't have to pay for it. Um, you can use it for free. And all you need is a course ID. Okay. So basically, Copy the course ID, copy, and then go to the Luma website. I'm gonna log out, show you how to register. So you just click on enroll in a new course. Right here, paste the course ID, right? Paste it here. You don't need the enrollment key, leave it blank. And then click on enroll. Then you should be able to see our course MAT150 section E053. And my name is here, that means it's good. Then you can click on enroll. Check the information, enroll, and then right here, if you are the first time using the Lumen, then you need to create a username, password, password, first name, last name, and email address. You can use your personal email address. And then check button, two options, click on submit, then your account will be created. Now, once you log in, right? Once you create your account and you can log in, when you log in, you should see all the homework assignments, quizzes, midterm finals available in the Lumen website. Now, um, let me walk you through really quickly. Okay, here. So when you log in, you should be able to see the orientation homework and it's still on July 21st. Okay, just basically help you get familiar with the Lumen you know, platform. And each chapter will have a homework and a quiz. Uh, for all the homework, you can try as many times as you want. Only the highest score will be counted. And for the quiz, you can try three times. Right? Also, the highest score will be counted. Okay. And so basically, that works for every single chapter. And also, all the due dates are listed below each assignment. Like homework, quiz has a due date beneath it. Okay, so follow the due date closely. And that's basically the homework system. They're very easy to get access to homework. And midterm, um, you have practice midterm, so you should use a practice midterm to prepare for actual midterm. And you're allowed to take the midterm two times, right? The highest score will be counted towards the final course grade. And that's the same thing for the final. Okay. So this is basically the uh, homework what the homework system look like. All right, so now um, let's take a look at, um, back to the formula, uh, the syllabus one more time. Let's continue on the syllabus. Okay. Let me open that one more time. So let's take care of the homework website. And um, so basically you need a scientific calculator of Excel, right? But uh, in the homework system, that's in that scientific calculator. You can also use that instead. And in the book, we are using Essential Statistics with Edition by Mario Triola. I already attached a PDF file of the test book down below here. So if you feel like you like to read the test book, go for it, right? It's available here. And uh, grade distribution, 40% of the grade is based on uh, homework. Quizzes is worth 20%. Midterm and final, each one is worth 20%. And basically, we cover uh, 
some basic statistics, um, including community theory, random variable, binomial distribution, normal distribution, central limit theorem, measure of the central tenant, tendency and then distribution, um, sampling distribution, chi square distribution, estimate and sample size, confidence interval, correlation regression, hypothesis testing. Right? Those are the major topics. And you have the if you register with the this, uh, this visibility of this, you know, if you send me an email, I will provide some proper accommodation for you. And the BMC policy on pressure is an academic integrity statement. Uh, so basically, um, no treatings on the quizzes, midterm, and finals. You could get help on the home assignment. Right? You can go to MathLab to help, but uh, no, no treating right? on the quizzes and the exams. And uh, those are all of the topics. So you can cover my chapters throughout the summer session two. Chapter one, introduction of stats. Chapter two, organizing and analyzing data. Chapter three, measure the center variations. Chapter four, probability. Chapter five, discrete probability distribution. Chapter six, normal distribution and central limit theorem. Chapter seven, confidence intervals. Chapter eight, I want this testing. Chapter 10, regression and correlation. In general, if you need help, go to MATLAB located at S535, the tourism service. So complete your coursework on time. If you have any questions, shoot me an email. And uh, that's pretty much everything on the syllabus. So since this is fully online class, we do not meet on a weekly basis. So that's everything on the syllabus. And let's move on to the next item. Also, I put together the formula sheet. So you can use the formula sheet um, for all the form when you complete the homework, quizzes, midterm, and finals. And all the formulas are, is organized by the chapters, so you can look it up right here. And also, there are a couple important tables in the back of the, the formula sheet. It's called table A2 and table A3. So you can use those tables in chapter six, seven, eight. Right. Yeah. Okay. That's all of, uh, where the formula she is. Okay. And also, um, I create a course guide, right? It's basically give you a summary of all the um, due date for each assignment. You can follow this course guide closely. It's consistent with the due date on the homework system, so you won't miss it, right? You can use both. Okay. I also have the, all the dates for the exams. Okay. So use this wisely. And uh, I also have all the lecture videos, a PowerPoint for each chapter. So um, summer two is pretty intensive, so you should follow the schedule closely. And uh, starting on uh, chapter one, right? Have uh, three YouTube videos. So basically, you open a PowerPoint on a weekly basis, on a daily basis. Open a PowerPoint and go through the um, lecture videos, and then you should be able to understand most of the content. And then uh, once you complete reviewing all the Next video point, then you can start working on the home assignments okay, for each chapter. So this is chapter one, and we do have uh, all the videos available here. Right? So you don't, you should always go over these videos before you're working on the home assignments. That will help you a lot. And uh, yeah, so the all lecture videos will be located here. And you should, that's a suggestive study, right? On each chapter, like chapter eight, you should start on August 15th and then complete it by 17th, right? So that's um, basically the, the schedule for the, to complete all the assignments here. So use this as well. Okay, and then also I created a, a shortcut link to the Lumen website here. 
Uh, so you can just use it to, to access the homework website. Okay. Yeah, so um, that's briefly everything I want to go over with you guys. So again, if you have any question, feel free to send me an email and I'll get back to you and try to help you out. I hope you enjoy the course.